I'm Marissa Bailey. Here are the stories making headlines at this hour. Copa has just released body cam video of a police involved shooting during a hostage situation in April. Police say 19 year old Marcus Melvis dragged a 23 year old woman into a bathroom of a West Town apartment and held her at gunpoint. Police ordered him to drop his gun and let the woman go. When he refused, they shot him. He did survive. An 11 year old girl escapes after she's abducted here in West Elsden on the city's southwest side. Police say she was walking home yesterday near Hernandez Middle School at 55th and St. Louis when a man picked her up and physically put her in a gray or white minivan. He held her captive for an hour before she managed to escape. She says the man was in his 50s wearing all black and had a mustache. A heart stopping sight in Naperville, a one year old little boy running down a busy Route 59. Trying to corral a one year old boy running across 59 just north of North Aurora. Hey, hey, hey! Oh, geez, the young child escaped his mother's watch and ended up down the road. Thankfully, Sergeant Anthony Menino was nearby and spotted the child, used his car to block traffic, and then chased the quick toddler down. The sergeant received a life-saving award for his quick actions. Mm -hmm. That video makes my stomach hurt every time I look at it. All right, guys, we look at a forecast out there today that shows us a chance of a few scattered showers and storms out there, most of which would happen in the morning. Hasn't really happened for us, so we're looking at cloudy skies, essentially kind of muggy and 83 degrees for your high temperature on your Tuesday. Wednesday, 82 degrees, a little bit cooler near the lakefront on your Wednesday. Thursday, some nighttime storm potential. And then we're looking at temps climbing way high, in fact, into the 90s for Father's Day weekend. All right, Megan, thank you, and keep it right here on CBS Chicago for updates throughout the day. Have a good Tuesday.